Konnichiwa, Minasan. Kyo desu. So, I will be reacting to another song by the group Blue Hearts, and this song is called Jonetsu Nobara. Now, in my original review um, of this artist, the Blue Hearts, in my last video, I had thought that he was disabled because of the way he was moving. And come to figure out, he's not disabled, actually. He's actually functioning quite well. It's just that that's his way or his style of performance. Now, for me, because I come from a background where, like, people, you find a lot of Americans or people in the West who are disabled that tend to move that way. So my mind is like, I didn't want to make fun of him because, you know, that's a very, you know, you don't want to be mean or inconsiderate. So that's why I thought, and I actually said in the video that I thought it actually added to his performance because I thought, you know, him having that struggle would be able to bleed out those feelings into his lyrics, but he's completely not like that. You know, he's a functioning uh, human being. So that's fantastic to hear. Uh, you guys wanted me to give another shot at the group because some of you said that, you know, maybe I didn't understand the song too much or I should try another song. So I'm trying another song. So without further ado. Buddy. So, go ahead. so I'm guessing that the message of the song is basically telling people to follow your passions and instead of like the, I guess the dumb or nonsensical logic that you've been taught to grow up in. You know, um, and obviously the lyrics really talk about how like the 
the answers to your problems are deep inside your mind, past all the tears and the frustrations and the pain and all that. Um, I relate to the song in a lot of ways because it's like, as a creative mind myself, um, I was never someone who liked school. Um, it's not really until high school or like my grades weren't the best and I wasn't the best student, but that's because I, I feel like for a lot of people, the path that society kind of lays out for us, it's frustration. It's frustra uh, frustrating because it's like, that's not what I want to do. And I know people sometimes want to look out for your better interests, but it's like, instead of people telling you, you know, follow your dreams or your passions, of course, within reason, um, instead of doing what is supposed to be right, you know? And as someone who was never really like much of a, 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 a how can I say, not a good student, but like, I was a good kid, but like, I, I was just so free and, and creative in my mind that I felt like school was a waste of time to me. But I know, I know he's not just talking about school, but just life in general, the misconceptions and the things that we've learned. It wouldn't be interesting if it was all crap, which I believe most of it is. Um, but I can see how this would encourage a lot of people because it's something that I can relate to as well, is that everyone tells you what you should do with your life, but you have your own desires, your own plans, but people kind of make fun of you and tell you you're not logical enough or you'll never do it, it's impossible. And it's like, you know, I'm gonna do what I feel is best for me and what I feel will give me fulfillment and what, you know, I feel like God put me on this earth to do. Because at the end of the day, I don't wanna be on my deathbed saying, I wish I could have done this instead of listening to those people who claim or they think that they knew what, what was best for my life. So um, I like this video. I like the performance. You know, I, I guess I'm understanding their style now, uh, but I, I did like their rocking tune and their stage performance. It was very good, but I, I definitely, I, I resonate with the lyrics of the song for sure. So if you guys like the video, please smash the like button, smash the subscribe button. Also hit that bell as well to get notified whenever we post a video. Arigato gozaimashita. Minasan. Gambate.